Greetings YouTube, happy Saturday. I have officially downloaded the iOS. Hopefully it will no longer crash or overheat update and I'll just kind of have to keep you advised as to whether or not I experience that again. I'm sure everybody on an iPhone will do just that. But really, that wasn't the main problem that I've seen in this game. And this really isn't the main problem that I've heard from you on the line app from so many people who've messaged me because as annoying and certainly as significant as the overheating problem was, for me, it mostly would just happen when I grinded the arena for like 30 minutes to 45 minutes sometimes. And even though it was super inconvenient to crash the game during a fight, I would say maybe only once, if that, I wasn't able to restart the fight in the arena. And so eventually I won it and, you know, no harm, no foul. Now, obviously, if that had happened, and it certainly has happened to people in Alliance Quest and Alliance War, the stakes of the crash are far higher as you lost health and got a uh, defensive kill with no opportunity to actually win the fight. And that was certainly the biggest issue. But I want to spend a brief few minutes today talking about what I think is the number one problem in the game. And it's a problem that's happened long before the overheating issue. And it, it continues to get worse, at least on my phone now, in uh, total clarification, total um, honesty, I play on an iPhone 6S. It's an older phone. I will be trying to upgrade in the next couple of months. But what I've noticed, and this has happened in the arena, but especially in Alliance Quest and Alliance War, is the dang problem of lag. I cannot tell you how many times in the arena, but especially in Alliance Quest and Alliance War, all of a sudden, mid-fight, my screen will just slow down, but what really, really sucks about the lag in this game and why it infuriates me to no end is that for some reason, even though you're, the lagging causes the movement of the player, so my movement, your movement, to slow down, it seems like the enemy's um, frame rate or the enemy's artificial intelligence doesn't slow down. So it is, in some cases, when the lag happens, impossible for me to, t to not only time a parry, but to intercept, to get a special off. I've done everything right. I've been in the middle of a combo. I've gone for a special two, like, say, with Star-Lord, and all of a sudden, the game will lag, and because it lags, there's just a split second of delay, and all of a sudden, the enemy, who without the lag would absolutely 100% of the time get hit with the special two, has suddenly found the ability to block it. And then, of course, once they block it, not only do I not cause the damage, but that allows them to go on the offensive attack. This has happened to me with Dormammu bosses. This has happened to me with really tough nodes in Alliance War. And I'm sure the people who are playing in the upper tier brackets, as I am just in gold one, have even more on the line when the lag happens. I also want to say that maybe it's just my device, right? Like, I would love for people to comment and be like, no, nah, man, I, I play on the iPhone X or the Samsung Galaxy, whatever, and the lag is still hurting me. But I feel like going forward, that is a much more significant issue. And who knows? I'm going to be optimistic. Maybe this overheating and crashing fix on the iOS also helps with some of the lag. But it's just, it's so infuriating. Last night, I was in a live stream and lag was so bad that I was having to basically feel like I was pulling the handle of a slot machine to fix any kind of momentum I had. Because also, there have been a few times where the lag is so bad, maybe it's just the Oklahoma lag because the state lags behind in literally everything. Uh, but I was at a point where all of a sudden I'd have like 20% damage gone because the lag would have to catch up to the fact that I had missed like the first three hits of a combo that I had undertaken in the arena. So I don't want the community to uh, not talk about the most significant issue in the game, and that's of lag. Because yes, the overheating is a crazy concern that has cost people battery damage. And it, it, you even hear stories of much worse than that, though I don't know how many of those have been proven. But if the lag persists and you are costing yourself really valuable potions and revives in Alliance Quest and Alliance War especially because you cannot get off your basic attacks in the game, that is a tremendous issue that should be addressed immediately. And so let's just pray 
that there's no more overheating issues, that the, the crashes stop, and then hopefully the game and the frame rate can speed up back to where it was so that we are not penalized with lag when we're doing everything right with a combo or with parrying or with intercepting, and yet we still find that we cannot win the fights without taking significant damage or even dying in the process. So that is my plea for you today on this Saturday. Let me know if it's just an iPhone 6S issue or if you've seen it on your device. But going forward, Kabam, please stop the lag. It really is hurting the game in so many significant ways. Thanks for watching, YouTube.